there have been 851 episodes of Doctor Who broadcast to date. Our mission? For every single one, say something nice. Hello dear viewers and welcome back to another episode of Say Something Nice. It may have only been a day for us, but it's been a month for the Doctor, The Trial of a Time Lord, Part 10. So this is the second part of the Verboids section of the trial, otherwise known as Terror of the Verboids, original working title, The Ultimate Foe. And look, this four episode segment is my favourite Colin Baker story. And you may have noticed why. It's Mel. <laughs> look, I'm not just going to say it's Mel for this, but Mel is involved in the bit that I've picked out for this episode, and that is the exploration of the Hydroponics Centre. The Hydroponics Centre was part of the cliffhanger that led into this episode, and the Doctor and Mel go back there to investigate. And right from when they're approaching, Mel realises that the Doctor's trying to distract her from the danger she was in and the character who died, Edwards, which could have been Mel when she was first exploring the Hydroponics Centre. And he says to her, like, you don't have to come in, but she pushes on, you know, she shows that bravery that companions have to have. And then their whole conversation when they're exploring the Hydroponic Centre, it's only a small moment, but again, it harks back to that thing I've spoken about with Mel before, in that she is an enthusiastic, willing character who wants to be involved in the adventure and solving mysteries. And you can tell that the Doctor has been written to respect that element of her character as well. And instead of just explaining everything to her that's going on, he encourages her to come to her own conclusions about what's happening. Indeed, in the story, Mel does most of the investigating, for reasons I'll talk about later when we get to part nine. But just them exploring together, enjoying each other's company, feeding back to each other and developing each other's ideas is something really nice about The Trial of a Time Lord, part 10. I almost said Terror of the Vervoids, part 2. But there is now a version of Terror of the Vervoids on here without the trial scenes, and I love it. Anyway, <laughs> uh, went off on a bit of a tangent there, but get this if you haven't already, and if you missed out on the UK version of the set, the Australian version of the set is either coming out soon or has just come out. I'll put a link in the description, and they do send internationally, so give that a go. They're not sponsoring me, I just think everyone should own this box set. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.